Now this is a case of ascites in uh, cirrhosis of liver and ascites, Hesapino magelli. Here is the gallbladder and uh, you can see the gallbladder dancing in the ascitic fluid. This is the gallbladder. Small lumen, tiny cystic area you see is the lumen and the uh, rest is the wall of the gallbladder. This segment is to show you how the gallbladder wall will appear in massive ascites in, because of any reason. However, in this patient it is because of cirrhosis of the liver at advanced stage. This is a shrunken liver. Now, this is a shrunken liver. surrounded by fluid and you know only shrunken liver can be seen in total by ultrasound the rest of the liver cannot be measured in centimeters or millimeters and it is only the shrunken liver that can be measured this liver measures 132 millimeters uh, sorry uh, yeah 132 millimeters or 13 centimeters and uh, this is the liver this area is the liver, shunken liver. This is the right diaphragm, and this black area you are seeing is all fluid surrounding the cirrhotic liver. These are bowel segments. This is the portal vein. This is the portal vein which is not dilated and is patent, clear lumen. This is IVC, this is liver, this is right diaphragm and this is the fluid surrounding the liver. The IVC measures 12.9 millimeters and the maximum upper limit of normal is 13, so it's not dilated. <coughs> There is no pleuroneuria. However, in this position, you can see that there is a focal vein within the liver. This is the focal vein. It is echogenic in the center and has a hypoechoic periphery. This is the liver in cut section. All of this is the cirrhotic liver, and this all is the fluid black area surrounding the liver. So this is a focal lean measuring approximately 19 millimeters into 27 millimeters. <coughs> See how the outer surface appears in a liver that is uh, that is shrunken with as massive as it is. Just See the outer surface. This is again a focal that we were seeing. 